Hello, fellow monsters. Sticker Monster here, and welcome back to Darkest Dream. Ah, it's getting so good. It's getting so good. So I'm, I'm pre-recording all this and seeing if you guys want to watch it and if you guys enjoy it. If you don't, I just simply won't post it, but you'll, I, I will probably post it. But, let's see. Um, let's do this. I'm, I love it so far. There's something on the floor. It's a note. It's not in a small room. It's not in a small room. Let's see, I had a lighter here somewhere. Got it. I got the lighter. My clothes are stocked in. I don't feel like reading at this moment. Only stuff. Step 5. The twilight passage in the darkest dreams, an omen of disaster, awaits at the end of the path of blood. Have you guys noticed each step that I do, there's another pile, like another puddle of blood? Okay, let's read the next one. There's something on the floor to note. The office is too obvious. I was thinking maybe the living room. I was honestly thinking the living room. Um, There's something on the floor to note. Not in the first room. Not the bedroom. Um... That the office is way too obvious. There's something on the floor to note. Be the guest. The guest room? Is there a guest room? I know there's a kitchen. And I know there's the living room. I don't know. Something. Not a place to live. So it's not a living room. I honestly thought it would be the living room, but... I am wrong, of course. I'm sticker, so I'm wrong about everything. Um, he's probably still in here, to be honest. There's something on the floor to note. The library has enough books. The only place that leaves that for is the guest room. And the guest room was the room across from mine, right? Guest bedroom. So he wrote it in the guest bedroom. Because it said, be the guest. It's not the living room. It's not the first room. It's not the office. The library is too, has too many books, so it's the guest room. It has to be, anyways. There's something on the floor, it's a note. The kitchen is no place to reach. Yeah, it, it's the guest room. Um, now I think he found a book here. Uh, the lever here or something? Ah! That scared the fuck out of me! That's not fair! Yeah, that's not fair. I'm a little, I'm an innocent little butterfly. Uh... Nope! Let's check the attic first. Can I even do that? Let's check the attic first. Oh, okay, never mind. Oh, yes! Let's just turn around on a fucking ladder. Do you see that shit? Yes! Fucking nailed it. Okay, you can use the lamp. I got it. Nailed it. Good. Ah! Oh! I don't like that. Creepy. Cracking wall, how is that? No, I fuck off! Oh god, trust me the fuck out! Ah, nope! Here to go. <laughs> fuck off! You little fucking fuck. Going to the. Don't fucking go away! Pretty sure something was following me. I have to hurry, the demons are after me. Going! Leave the room. Oh, fucking balls! Go, 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 go! Is this room? Yes, burn the book, burn the book, burn the book, burn, burn, burn the book, burn the book, burn the book, burn, burn, burn! What? Where am I? What is this place? Some sort of hospital? Has the nightmare not ended? Have I failed? No, you're just psycho and you were in the hospital in a coma. Oh no, the book is still here. Mr. Frey, you are awake? Huh? Who are you? What am I doing here? I was in my house. Calm down, sir. 
How can I be calm after all that's happened? Am I still dreaming? You have to lower your voice, Mas Mr. Master. Mr. Master. This is the first time we see you lucid since... What are you talking about? Since when? Five years. No, that's impossible. You are lying. This is part of the nightmare, isn't it? Sir, I told you to please calm down. If not, I'll call the doctor to give you tranquilizers. And we shall talk when you wake up again. No, don't make me go to sleep again. They will kill me. I'm sorry, it's obvious you are very nervous. Believe me, I understand, but I have to call the doctor now. No! Well, you're just a fucking idiot for panicking. Like, that's entirely your fault. And so your journey ends here, Frey. I can't move. Okay, here we go. M Morpheus? Yes, human. What do you mean, end here? What is going on? Everything is settled now. The nightmare is ended and I can definitely erase it. And it's all thanks to you, Frey. So, I am free, but what am I doing in this place? This place is simply reality. But I was in the house. What is this? No, you were not in the house. You have been here since everything started five years ago. What are you talking about? And no, you are not free. You still have to pay for the damage you have caused. What? It's ironic that the one who started this all has been the same person who has ended it. Still don't remember, hmm? It's fair that you at least recovered your past memories. Oh, fuck. He's the guy, isn't he? Take a look at the first page of the book, Frey. Oh, dude. No, this isn't true. The Darkest Dream by Frey Smith. Do you remember now, Frey? You bastard. You both tricked me, huh? Lucifer and you. In my case, it's just a matter of justice. You interfered in my responsibilities, so I acted in consequence. I transformed your mind so you couldn't remember and made it part of the nightmare. But Lucifer... He's how he is. Did you really think he would give you such powers only for some souls? Poor human, Lucifer always has the upper hand on his deals. I told you, he can give you the power to add, but you will never have control over me and my own reality. This was a lesson, Frey. You created the worst nightmare, and I made you go through it. Now it is time for you to face your punishment. But I escaped the dream. You said this is reality, so you don't have any power here. It surely is reality. Do you know where we are, Frey? It's a sanatorium. I've been here in coma since I sold the house to that stupid Morton guy and the pact with Lucifer began. It's true, you were here, but this is only a carcass. Now you are dead and you are in hell. No, you are lying. I'm afraid I'm not, Frey. It's time for me to go. Lucifer has already claimed your soul and the dream has finally ended. I have nothing else to do. No, you can't leave me here. Farewell. No! What the fuck? So I was the asshole all along. That is so fucking cool. Ooh, God. That was... Okay, that was kind of cool. That had a good little twist in the end. Um, I honestly thought there was going to be a good end. But that's probably, it probably only has one end unless you burn it in the wrong place. Um, I don't really want to try that though, that sounds dumb. But that, that is pretty fucking cool. Um, unless maybe I get the good end if I don't burn it in that. Okay, so let's see if we just burn it in this room. What happened? I'm in my room. No monsters? Is it over? I'll take a look around. God be with me. Use the house key. I, I can't believe it. I'm finally outside. It's over. No, it's not. Wrong room, human. Keep dreaming the darkest dream. Forever. Okay, so there's not a good ending. You just die either way. That's a bummer.
I, I was hoping you could get a good ending. That was a fun game, though. I'm gonna go ahead and link it in the description if you guys wanna play it, see if there's anything else that I might have missed. Um, it was fun. It was definitely a lot of fun. Um, if you, I hope you guys are enjoying these RPG horror games, because I'm gonna be, I, I want to play a lot more. Um, it's just something that I personally really enjoy. I do have a series coming up with my little brother soon. It's gonna be a game called Dark Secret. Um, go ahead and look up the trailer for it if you want. I'm gonna be doing a playthrough on it. And it looks really, really fucking good. I think it came out in April or something like that. I'm not entirely sure. But, oh god, I'm so happy I'm getting back into my horror stuff. And I'm sure you guys are happy about it too. Because it's been a while since I've played horror games. I became a little puss for a little bit. Because I was like, oh god, no, I don't want to get scared. But now I'm starting to get back in my cravings where I'm like, ooh, fucking scare me. Let's do it. Also, another question I wanted to ask you. Do you guys want me to do a playthrough on Layers of Fear as well? I'm, I really like the whole idea with it and I think it'd be a great idea and also if you guys want some more amnesia custom stories let me know I know I'm rambling but I know this is gonna be a really short video if I don't then I don't wanna like I don't wanna like make like a six eight minute video I mean I guess I could but you know anyways thank you guys for watching I really appreciate it if you like this video finger that like button for me and remember when there's a shout the monster's up <laughs>